thank you so much. I uh, like to open up with a classic impression. This is uh, it's a Robert De Niro impression. Here we go. And I should give you a heads up, it's not like a thing where I'm making fun of him, just an accurate De Niro, then we'll get to the comedy. Here we go, Robert De Niro. Just a for, be forewarned. Uh, so Robert De Niro, not making fun of him, and it's just a look, no words. Okay, here we go, Robert De Niro. God damn it. Um, hold on, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it right, we're competing. So Robert De Niro, so Robert De Niro is just an accurate De Niro, uh, uh, no words, right? Just a look. Don't call me a liar. Here we go. Robert De Niro as a lizard. Here we go. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Uh, uh, it's a favorite character of mine. This is, this is Bruce Lee, and he's meeting a very cute baby for the first time. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. <laughs> oh, before I go any further, we gotta talk about the news. Uh, did you guys hear about Obama? Did you guys hear about this? Nobody? Okay, wow, okay. Um, first black president. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. <laughs> I, uh, I'm uncircumcised, anyone else? Um, we're a bunch of heroes, good, good for you. Fun way to live your life. Uh, every time I bring this up on stage, someone will come up afterwards, they go, isn't it dirtier? They'll walk up intentionally to my face and they'll go, isn't it unclean? What do you circumcised people think that I'm doing? that would cause so much grime to accumulate on the day-to-day, -day, like tilling the fields with my penis. Mm. Poking around a bag of Doritos, looking for a good one. Hmm. Let's see, hmm, seen that chip. That's old news. Hmm. Just clean it with soap and water. There's no mystery. We figured it out long ago. Like, it's not like I'm some infomercial where I'm like, I scrub and scrub and it just won't get clean. Ah! Introducing soap and water. It's e just, you're in the shower. You're in, you're already in the shower. How late are you for work that you're going, yeah, I'm gonna skip to my knees. Let's wrap this up. I'm bored. Let's get chicken for breakfast. Mm, wrap this. I had a buddy of mine, he was, uh, he was in a sketch group with me, right? We're in a sketch group. We're changing very quickly backstage between sketches. And uh, he catches a glimpse of my uncircumcised penis and he says to me, he says, I'll never forget it, he says, <laughs> That's it, and he just walks away. Just... I played it cool, I played it cool. I played it cool, I was like, oh, show must go on, all that bullshit. <laughs> Could have argued right there, really. <laughs> Afterwards, I was like, hey man, so I'm uncircumcised. What's the big deal? One love. <laughs> and he's a really good guy. He, he very politely explained to me that it wasn't that I was uncircumcised. It was that even for being uncircumcised, he felt I had a little extra skin. So if the common metaphor is like, oh, a turtleneck, like, <laughs> I've got more of like a druid's cloak. <laughs> Assassin's Creed. I don't know what I wanted him to say though, in that scenario, right? Because he went, ugh, like my penis had shot him in an old Western, like, ugh, ugh. <laughs> What did I want, though? Instead of going, ugh, he'd be like, ooh, yum, 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 yum. Like, what do I want? <laughs> At that point, I would have settled for, oh, I would have been fine. <laughs> I'd like to close with uh, uh, my favorite character. This is Gay Rodney Dangerfield. <laughs> they think I said real Rodney Dangerfield. This is Gay Rodney Dangerfield. All right. <laughs> 
<laughs> Boy, Austin, what a city, what a city, you know? Good food, better cock. <laughs> Hooking up with this guy the other day, you know? Things are going pretty well, pretty fast. We didn't use protection. The next morning he says, Rodney, you gotta tell me, do you have AIDS? I said, AIDS? I can hardly afford a secretary. <laughs> Boy, you know, my ex-wife, I'll tell you. <laughs> she doesn't exist. <laughs> I got no but sex, no but sex. You know. Got excited one time, guy told me he liked it doggy style, got all worked up, you know. <laughs> then he made me come in a corner and he rubbed my nose in it. Making out with this guy in the men's room the other day, you know, things are going pretty well. I said, hey buddy, suck my dick. He said, sure. So I dropped my pants, he starts to walk away. I said, hey buddy, what gives? Get back here, suck my dick. He said, it's too late. I said, what do you mean it's too late? He said, it's too late, your dick already sucks. Oh! 